This is a shield that all the co-op taxis, they have it, our supplies to clean up gloves, masks. This is the new normal for many taxi drivers across Canada. Lots of people, they need the transportation. They have to go from point A to B. Sometimes they have to go see the doctors. They have to go see, you know, the shopping. Our job is to pick them up and drop them off. They don't have another option, some people. And it's not only people the drivers are transferring. We have lots of deliveries from the hospital to hospital which is we wear a mask and gloves, we do our job. From plastic coverings like this to the continuous cleaning of vehicles every time a passenger is inside, many drivers are doing what they can to stay safe. Of course, our job is dangerous. You know, driving taxi in Edmonton or in North, in North America, that's a dangerous job, in a, you know, you can even, even imagine. But the virus going on is make it more. In Edmonton, passengers can no longer sit in the front seat of a cab, only the back. With all the precautions cities and vehicle for hire companies are taking, there's also some onus on the customer. Co-op taxi driver Mihir Dad Aliza Day urges those who are symptomatic to reconsider taking a cab. Somebody just... Don't tell us, we don't know. We are not a doctor. We are not going to check the people. We don't do the temperature test. So the people that call in, we go pick them up and drop them up. I said, it's not our job to question that. The city of Edmonton also requires any vehicle that provides service to a passenger who demonstrates COVID-19 symptoms to immediately be removed from service and thoroughly sanitized. From Edmonton, Sherolta Saskew, City News.